Today we are going to talk about renewable energy sources. There are five kinds of renewable energy sources and these are wind, biomass, hydropower, solar and geothermal. In this short video we will present you the applications, pros and cons of geothermal energy. Geothermal energy refers to the natural thermal energy of the earth that flows from the warm interior of the planet to the surface. The adjective geothermal originates from the Greek roots ye, meaning earth, and thermos, meaning hot. There are two main applications of geothermal energy. The first application of geothermal energy is power generation. In this picture, we are going to show you a typical geothermal installation for the use of electricity. The water is fed into the soil by a special pipe overheated by the heat supplied by the geothermal surface. Therefore, superheated steam has the ability to move the steam turbine connected to the generator shaft in order to produce electricity. Another application is for geothermal heating and cooling. Mostly works by circulating water in the closed system through a loop field installed horizontally or vertically in the ground, close or even beneath a building. Heat is taken from the building and transferred to the ground in the summer and also the system is reversible and during the winter heat is taken from the ground and is used in the building. The system only moves heat which is more uh, efficient than using fuel or electricity. In that way it can produce cheaper and additionally environmental friendly energy. The advantages of using geothermal energy are plenty. Some of them are mentioned below. First of all, it reduces the consumption of fossil fuels. Moreover, it can reduce the production of greenhouse gases as well as various pollutants. Another important benefit provided by using geothermal is that it can be used for remote applications such as satellites, rural hospitals equipment in developing countries and telecommunication equipment. It can also reduce the water consumed in electrical generation processes by displacing electrical demands. The final but also major advantage is that it can provide energy independence to the consumers. On the other hand, the use of geothermal energy has some disadvantages. Firstly, this kind of energy is not universally available. Moreover, it is more expensive than electricity produced by fossil fuels because of the installation cost. Last but not least, improper drilling into Earth can release hazardous minerals and gases such as carbon dioxide and cause soil erosion. These few cons, however, cannot be compared to the advantages and positive impact of the use of geothermal energy and generally renewable sources to the environment. We must not forget that conventional sources are running out and we should focus on alternative ones such as geothermal energy. The end.